Hello everyone, this is day 4 of our journey and in today's lecture we are going to talk about classification of lipids. What are the type of lipids that are available and uh, here as you can clearly see we are going to discuss about 5 different types of lipids. So let's begin. So the first type is fatty acids. Take a color. The first is fatty acids and among fatty acid uh, then we have triglycerides, then we have phospholipids, then fourth one steroids and the fifth one waxes these are all five different types of lipids that we have okay now if you go inside the fatty acids the chemical nature of the fatty acid is it's a long hydrocarbon chain with a carboxyl group to it so fatty acid has a hydrogen and carbon atom linked together it's a hydrocarbon chain but it carries a carboxyl group to it the function of fatty acids are as an energy storage insulation cellular signaling the example of fatty acids palmitic acid stearic acid oleic acid there are plenty of examples now let's move to the second type this is triglycerides another very common fat chemical nature by chemical nature they are glycerol they have glycerol backbone and there are three fatty acid chains linked to it okay so obviously a glycerol backbone and it has three separate chains where three chains of hydrocarbons are linked to it then what are the bonds or the type of bond that is present the bond type is known as ester bonds here and the function is that it has energy storage function insulation organ protection function because triglycerides play vital role as energy storage particularly as energy storage component of our body in adipose tissue then comes the example of triglyceride butter olive oil avocado oil all are examples of triglycerides and in our body serum triglyceride is very important parameter while we check for the lipid profile next move to the third type that is phospholipids the chemical nature it has a glycerol backbone two fatty acids are linked and a phosphate groups are linked the difference between a triglyceride and a phospholipid is that in triglyceride there are three fatty acids linked to the glycerol backbone but in case of phospholipids there are only two uh, fatty acids linked to the glycerol backbone and one phosphate group is connected the fourth type are steroids but before that uh, let's talk about the bond type that are present here in case of phospholipids it's ester linkage phospho di phosphoester bonds that are present in here so the ester linkage is very common in case of triglyceride it is also common in case of phospholipids now what are the function of phospholipid cell membrane structure and signaling and lipid transport inside the cell so these are all important constituent and function of phospholipids the example is phosphatidylcholine phosphatidylserine phosphatidylmyelin phosphat phos sphingomyelins phosphatidylethanolamine these are example of phosphogly uh, phospholipids okay phosphatidylcholine phosphatidylserine sphingomyelin so very similar but little difference between phospholipids and triglycerols now if you talk about the steroids the fourth type chemical nature is four fused carbon rings are seen the first time instead of having individual branches of fatty acids we have a fused carbon ring and that's the steroids and now if you talk about the functions function as hormone production membrane structure and vitamin d synthesis all of these role played by steroids Example cholesterol, testosterone, estrogen, major hormones, major hormones that are involved in the sexual characteristics of male and female, testosterone, estrogen act as a steroids. Okay. Then fifth type, last category of lipids here, waxes. Chemical nature, long chain fatty acids and long chain alcohol are linked together. Bond type ester linkage is there as a bond type. Function waterproofing, protecting coating is a function of them example b wax okay jojoba wax cranuba wax these are all example of wax generally produced by plants and different families of plants to provide a coating in top of the leaf and surface of the plant okay so these are waxes waxes are little complex uh, type of uh, lipids because they have long fatty acids and a long chain of alcohol linked together okay so these are all five major classes of lipids that are found in uh, the organisms in living organisms be it animals be it plants okay so i believe you have a clear idea now 
So watch this whole series of mind map and it's our journey of 365 days. One mind map every single day for a year. And I bet you that you're going to come up as a better source of knowledge for the field of biological sciences after this one year of study. So continue with this series because it's going to provide you benefit for CSR net, get LS, get biotechnology, ICMR, JRF, uh, the Q8 PG, uh, BHU JNU examination and all the other institutional PhD entrance examination as well. So if you like this video, please hit the like button, share this video with your friends and subscribe to this channel to get more videos like that in future. All the very best for future career.